Well, good evening to you and uh, welcome to this most perfect evening for a game of football. Conditions are absolutely splendid and the folk of this town have come out in their droves for this match. Why wouldn't they? It is an ideal circumstance for what could be an ideal game. Everybody has been attracted to it. It has been the talk of the town and uh, the buses have been packed. Double-decker buses lining up outside. Coaches have carried thousands of away supporters here too and uh, all of it adds up to make a terrific and crackling atmosphere the match i think will be quite a spectacle this one of the great amphitheaters of the game you are welcome to it and indeed to one of the grandest fixtures well there are plenty looking forward to seeing this a capacity crowd here well, on the face of it, Peter, we would appear to have a high-caliber meeting with very little at stake. But then you consider a, a chance for one or two of the fringe players to get a look in, and this becomes a big incentive. It changes the dynamic. So there's plenty at stake for them, which will do no harm to the energy levels and the overall conviction, and hopefully the style of contest. And already we're on the way here. Ball needed to be better there, that's a wasted chance. Hoists it forward. It's come loose. Rafael Toloy simply had to make that count, and he did it with some authority too. Wonderful. It's a decent ball, and Zapata! And he's done it! First blood draw. Perfect placement, the one place the keeper couldn't reach. Now that's what I call finishing, right in the corner. He knew instinctively who was where and didn't need to waste any time weighing things up. That's a cracking goal. Atalanta, draw first blood here. He's just gone and reminded us yet again of what a threat he carries. Gets it upfield, cuts it out. It's a loose ball. Duron, he's given away a free kick. That's just very well played. He can't hurt you with his back to goal, and he didn't go for the back here. Forward it goes. And it's Gomez. Gets good distance on it. He's got options out wide. He's made sure that that won't get through. Gets it back. It's a busy front line, uh, lots of movement. And is that working for you? Well, not really. To be honest, I, I'm not a great fan of taking goal potential away from the penalty box. If he's had a look, and he's blown his whistle for half-time. So there you have it, a close sport half of football, but like it still had its moments. It ultimately produced just one goal. Both a decent game up to now. Reflections on the first... Yeah, he's pulled him up for that challenge. Keeper sends it forward. Across the field it goes. Dinks one in. Zapata. Keeper's got good distance on that.
And here's Gomez. Duron plays. That's a hit! Oh, that is rather wayward. All he'd be thinking is, please, ground, swallow me up. And it's played forward. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Tries to get it forward quickly. Duron drives it forward. Over to the left. Played back in. Goes for goal! Oh, nearly. But nearly is nothing. Good effort, very good effort. He would have at least wanted to make the keeper work, though. And he just whacks it away. Oh, terrible part. And the shot! Oh, great save. Real class. Longo is very sporting here to acknowledge the quality of the save. A lovely little footballing moment. Well, that's good stuff. This is better. This isn't the time to talk about risks now, Jim, is it? They just have to hurl everything at it and hope for a break. Just has to be done. Tries to get it clear. And here's Muriel. Luis Muriel. Chance! No mistake! And there's the goal they've been looking for. The keeper deserves some sympathy there. He may not have seen that until too late. His second of the game, and an eye now for the hat trick. Things starting to look very comfortable. It's come through. Duron goes looking. And the counter is on. And he's straight offside. Josip Ilicic. Back to the keeper and go again. Zapata desperately wants to get on the end of this. Luis Muriel right through the middle. Gomez! Oh, that was nice, but not quite the end product required. Well, and there goes the final whistle. So they bask in their win, a genuinely professional performance, and the result which is well deserved. So Jim, how do you reflect on what we've seen?